Hi. Good morning, everybody. I'm vlogging today. Woo! -hoo! Round of applause. I really love vlogging, but I have to spread them out because I do the same thing every fucking day. I wake up, I eat, I drink my coffee, I maybe exercise, although today I am not in the mood, so I don't think that's gonna be happening today. I try to cook something, and then I play the drums, and then I touch my cats at some point, and then I go to bed. I'm a simple gal. I don't know why I'm so hungry. It's like 9.30, I'm never this hungry this early. <laughs> I'm trying to think about what I could make. I'm definitely gonna do something with these two eggs. I also have some avocado. Let's see if the avocado is still good. I made curry soup the other day. Again, it's, I've made this recipe before. And oh my God, it's so good. And I made my mom try it and she was like, cause my mom's in town, it's not bad. Anyway, I made my mom try it. And she was like, this is fire. I was like, okay queen. I know. A really yummy thing you can do with your eggs is put pesto in it. I just found out about this recently and it's so good. But I also kind of want to make a breakfast burrito because I haven't done that in a long time. My tortillas are moldy. My tortillas are moldy. Hey, my tortillas are moldy. What do I do? Fuck, I'm such an idiot. I feel like this one's fine. I know I always make a breakfast burrito slash breakfast taco of sorts, but like it wouldn't hurt you to see the recipe again. It's a delicious recipe. Recipe. Okay, so basically, as I was talking about earlier, yeah, I made soup. I'll show it to you. These are a little bit old. I think it's fine. Look at my soup. Can you believe that I made this? It's fucking spilled all over, but I made this soup and it's so good. I'm just checking to see if anything in my refrigerator isn't rotten right now. Like that smells fine. Oh, I got a new toaster oven. As you can see, it's massive. I'm super excited about it because it has an air fryer in it. It's an air fryer. Toaster. Literally, technology is crazy these days. So I'm super stoked to try it. Uh, we can try it all together today, and that could be a fun activity. Okay, squishing my sausage, vegetarian sausage in there. Yeah. yeah. Another thing, if you guys watched my last video, or the video before it, I was talking about how I only wear that one red fleece. Well, guess what? I found another red fleece. So now I have two red fleeces that I wear to bed. Why do my avocados only ever look mediocre? I never have like a super sexy avocado, ever. Maybe once every blue moon. Nobody ever talks about how important it is to have sharp knives if you wanna cook. It makes all the difference. Like cooking is easier and way more fun when you have sharp knives. Listen, if you're under the age of 10, don't, you didn't hear me say that. I burned my sausages, which means that I did a good job. Now we're gonna put my egg in it without mixing it first, which is gross. Give me a second because this is really intense. Oh my God, it's time for me to use my new toaster and I have no idea. I'll just heat it up, you know what? Yeah. Wait, ah, I don't know how to use this. Oh my God, I don't know how this toaster works. It has to preheat. Cancel, I don't get it. I'm warming up my tortilla in the pan because that's too much for me. That was stressful. I'll see you when I plate it. I know that the cheese isn't melted. Vegan cheese doesn't melt anyway, so what's the point of trying to melt it? I wanna stop eating breakfast foods in the morning. And it's not like that I just wanna rebel, it's because I don't even, like I like breakfast foods, but not every day. Like I don't like, I, I would rather eat something else for breakfast. That's kind of fucking beautiful. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Can somebody tell me who decided that bacon was a breakfast food? I'm I'm curious. Like when like at what time stamp was it during the Civil War? I don't know. Another interesting point, breakfast foods are different around the world. So why is it in America that it's eggs and bacon, but somewhere else is something different? Why? Who made that decision? I'm trying to decide whether or not I'm I'm in a bad mood. <laughs> you ever do that? It's the morning. And you're like, okay, am I gonna be in a bad mood today? Like I'm just trying to figure that out right now. I decided because I'm filming and we're gonna hang out today, me and you, I'm not gonna be in a bad mood. I know, I'm so nice and thoughtful. I'm still deciding whether or not I'm in a bad mood. I don't know. <laughs> Nothing a little drums can't fix. Oh, would you look at that? It's dark out. It's the same day and it's 10. You can't see. I mean, I guess you could just trust me. Let's talk. Let's talk because I didn't film for the rest of the day. And why is that? Because I had a mental breakdown. Yes, I did. And you guys are probably like, Emma, can you stop having those? The thing is, think about how much you have them. It's more common than we think. Maybe. I had a meltdown. I, I just wanted to lay in bed. Like I didn't want to film anything. I didn't want to like talk to anybody. I didn't want to talk at all. I didn't want to exercise. I didn't want to read an email. Like I just didn't want to do 
anything. I felt like that was being a failure. I ended up taking the day to rest. I had probably two or three mental breakdowns today, like where I started crying. Actually, only one was a mental breakdown. Two were just me crying. One, I had a freak out. I did, I freaked out. You know when you freak out and you're like, I can't move and I'm good and I can't get up. Anyway, that happened. And my dad was like, you need to go for a walk or a run or something. So I ended up going on a jog and that really helped. And I cried and people were walking their dogs and they were seeing me cry, but it was beautiful. And I feel better now. And then my dad sent me a drum beat to learn. And I learned it in like two seconds. Do you want to see? Fuck. Fire. That feels hella good to do. Like when I do it, I'm like, ooh, 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 ooh. So we're gonna try again vlogging tomorrow, right? Like maybe tomorrow will be better. I also try to take an Instagram photo myself. Like I try to take a selfie. Hated every single one. I also have indigestion, but I also did cook today. I made broccoli in the oven. And I burnt it actually, and I ate it anyway. How dope was that drum beat though? Anyway, I don't think I'm gonna brush my teeth tonight. I don't really want to, but I'll see you tomorrow. And I know that the video is not over, so it's like, I don't need to give you a forehead kiss, but I'm going to sleep, so I still wanna give you a forehead kiss early. Do you guys mind? I'm just asking to make sure it's okay. I know it's a little bit early, but I'm, I, I, you'll still get one at the end of the video. I'm just doing one, a little forehead kiss a little early. Good night, sweetheart. Well, you might not be, you're not going to bed because you're still watching my video. But um, I'm going to bed, so good night from me. But you're still staying up. Wait, I can't become a drumming channel. Like, what? why do I keep? Am I like bragging? But I'm not good. Like, I'm not good enough to brag. So it's like this weird middle ground of me like showing it. And like anybody who actually knows how to play drums is like. Fuck, I fucked up. I fucked up. Literally shut up. Everybody shut up. I'm literally not even brushing my teeth tonight. YOLO! <laughs> Some people have been saying recently, oh, Emma started drumming, she changed. Nobody said that. <laughs> Nobody ever said that. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> Forehead kiss. I'm losing it. It's the next day, check. I had a decent morning. It's like 11 a.m. I woke up early, I watched TikToks, I went for a jog. It felt terrible jogging. It hurt, I didn't want to do it. I played drums for like an hour. I ate breakfast, I made coffee, like whatever. I've done it. I've done my morning routine. I need to shower, I don't want to. Um, I tried out a new texturizing spray because now that my hair is short, you wanna see how short it is, I'll show you. My hair is short, so I have to put in texturizing spray or else it looks like I'm a border collie. See, okay, but the problem is I put this texturizing spray in and it made my hair feel disgusting. And it's been in my hair for like three days and it's not good. So like I need to wash it, but I don't want to. Also, I just sweated all over my body when I went for my job, but I'm gonna do a face mask. I don't know, I feel like this is like a self-care day. Like always the day after a mental breakdown, it's like, okay, let's recharge. Maybe I'll try to look cute today. I feel like I do this in every vlog. I'm like, okay, let's like get ready. Okay, let's go to the store. Okay, let's cook something. Okay, bye everybody. See you next week. Life hack about doing face masks. I tend to be lazy when it comes to face masks because I'm like, okay, like, oh fuck, it's in my eye. I am lazy about face masks because I don't want to like stand there and wash it off. But if you put it on before you plan on showering, hello, then you wash it off in the shower. Do you want to hear my, do you want to hear me play drums again? Are we sick of that yet? I sound so much better at that new beat today that I want to show you. So I will. Fine, I'll show you. Still sounds like shit. Okay, so it's like, what do I do now? Cause it's like, I'm not hungry. Cause I already ate. I had leftover broccoli and like four spoonfuls of peanut butter for breakfast. Like that's, like, that's where I'm at right now. <laughs> what if I baked something? No, see, no. What do I want to do? Can we think, let's have a powwow. Let's have a meeting. Let's have a meeting about what the fuck I should do. Nobody is allowed to talk to me for the next rest of my life. That's step one. I could cook, sure, but I don't really want to do that today. Um, I could sit and play drums all day. Okay, sure, but my uh, shins get tired when I play drums for more than like three minutes. I could shower. I could make myself look cute. Okay, great, but then it's like, where do I go? There's nowhere to go. I know I just got an air fryer and I know I could go use that and that would be fun, but it's like, uh. I have cauliflower that I could cook in there. I also have indigestion. Mm, I got nothing.
I don't want to shower, but this is good for us, okay? If you haven't showered yet today or this week, let's shower together. It will help us during our time of sadness and pain. Showering always helps. You guys know that, we know that. Get out of bed, pause the video, take a shower, come back. Illy. Out of the shower. I am not in the mood to do my full skincare routine. So I'm just gonna put on some oil and hope that that's enough. I would put on sunscreen, but I'm really not going outside. Maybe I should anyway. Just a little bit of sunscreen. Never hurt anybody. I'm actually getting hungry, and I think this is a perfect time to try out my air fryer. The virality, is that a word? My air fryer is actually connected to my toaster, so we'll see if that makes it better or worse. I don't know. Oh my God. I hate short hair. On me. I really hate it. Put on, check. See, now it's like hair is out of the question. It's not even a discussion point anymore. Oh, all of my Chamberlain coffee mason jars are dirty. What is a girl to do? You wanna know what I did last night that really made my day? I went through my Spotify and I made all of my playlists, like I, I updated all of my playlists. And then I just renamed them to things that were like a little bit more interesting. For example, um, my favorite playlist that I have is called My Dad's Kitchen. And it is all of the songs that would echo from my dad's kitchen into my room as a child. So that was really, so if you're kind of bummed out like me and don't have anything to do and are gonna play with your air fryer all day to like pass time, um, I recommend updating your Spotify playlist. Whoever closed this almond milk glass really didn't do a good job. Oh wait, it was me. I hate being roommates with myself. Like literally I'm the one that leaves all the dishes in the sink. That's me, but then I'm also the one that finds it. And it's like, who did that? Well, it's always me. Let's figure out what we can air fry. Cause I have, I'm kind of actually out of groceries, but you best believe I'm not gonna go grocery shopping until it's a literal fucking emergency. So I have this leftover cauliflower. This is screaming to me, please air fry me. So I will, but I don't really get how it works. Do I like add oil to it? Like, how does this work? <clears throat> okay, that's really not a lot of cauliflower, but also it's probably better this way because if it ends up being disgusting, then like we didn't waste. Even when I get like pre-cut shit, I still cut it myself because I don't like how they do it. Foil, put this here, and then put out the cauliflowers on it. Drizzle of olive oil, I don't know, some salt, all-purpose seasoning that I just inhaled into my nose, and put it in the air fryer and see what happens. Okay, well, that's preheating. I think that a new pair of shoes came in the mail for me. <gasps> they did. Are you fucking? Woo! This just made my day. The fact that I got new shoes today means that I might need to go run errands. Like this, this, these new shoes make me want to run errands. Let's try them on. Oh. <gasps> Wait, these are, these are fire. That leads us into our sponsor of today's video, which is GOAT. Thank you, GOAT, for sponsoring this video. Wait, actually, I'm so sorry, goat. You guys are gonna need to wait because my air fryer is preheated and we need to pop these, these bad boys in. Oh my God, this is so exciting. Okay, anyway, goat is basically where I get all my shoes. It is a global platform for all things past, present, and future. Goat has got it all. You can get exclusive sneakers, just drop sneakers, apparel. They got all of it on the app from the world's leading brands. All resale products are verified. They're verified and authenticated by goat. So you know you're not getting ripped off. You know you're getting the real stuff. You're pretty much guaranteed to get the best product. As you can tell by my shoe game today, check. I'm obsessed with, well, I love dunks. They're comfortable, they're like easy to wear, and they're basically like a way cooler Air Force One. Also the yellow detail on them, unreal. And these will be on the GOAT app too if you want them and you want to twin with me. They're the women's dunk glow in Coast, by the way. You're welcome. Also, I made a sneaker collection on GOAT if you wanna shop all my favorite sneakers. I'm not the biggest sneaker head. I don't know everything about sneakers, but I know what I like. I made a collection on GOAT so you can check it out and the link is in the description and you can shop it. Anyway, I love you GOAT. I get so many of my clothes and shoes from you guys because I trust you and I love you and you have it all. And thank you for sponsoring this video. It's done. This is hot. Here's what our little cauliflower friends look like. Let's plate it up and put a sauce on it. I could have let them go longer, but that is also user error and not air fryer error. So we have our cauliflower. I bought this spicy chipotle dressing that's vegan and gluten-free and all that. I actually don't like this sauce at all. Putting it back in the fridge. <laughs> what? Okay, I like this sauce better. This is a lemon tahini dressing. Let's put it down all over there. Just for you guys, I'm gonna put on a piece of rosemary. Wow! And then I'm gonna immediately remove it and put it back in the packaging because I don't actually wanna eat the rosemary. Anyway, let's try. 
I can say I understand the hype with the air fryer because it cooks really quick. It does a pretty good job cooking the thing all the way through. It's easy. I'm not mad about it. I think I'm gonna take a moment to draw and think about what um, I should do with my life. Nothing makes me feel better than running errands, which is funny because it's like, that's not very fun, but it's like this relief in serotonin I get from running errands. So I feel like I need to do that today. But the problem is I'm so unmotivated to do it. It's so much easier to just lay in my bed, but I know that I'll feel good if I go and run errands. So I'm gonna set a goal for myself today. I actually need to go grocery shopping. I just made my last vegetable that I had in the fridge. I have nothing left now. And I also need to go return a pair of pants that I bought that didn't fit me. Anyway, I'm gonna draw a picture. Maybe I'll draw a coffee mug. The other day I decided to paint a pickle because I was sad and bored. Mm, that looks like shit. And shockingly, me painting made me feel really good and calm. Drawing is good, even if you suck at it. What the fuck is that? It sucks. And there's my mason jar of the day. Okay, I drew something. Nobody can say that I'm not taking the steps for my mental health. <coughs> I'm gonna do one more drawing and then I'm gonna run my errands. Is this silver? Ooh, fun silver. I'm just gonna draw something really fast and see what, Frankie. Okay, I'm just gonna draw something really fast. Wait, why is this kind of fire? Maybe it's like art is better if you're not thinking about it. Wait, like this is actually kind of cute and good. Wait, like this is not bad at all. Maybe that's gonna become my new thing, like doing super fast, just like drawings of things and seeing what happens. Cause this is kind of fire. Wait, what if I like added other colors to this? Like, what if I like added, no, do you want, it's good the way it is. I'm not gonna touch it cause I will ruin it. Okay, I'm gonna do one more. Let's do like a, I don't know. I'm just gonna like let it happen. That might've been a one hit wonder because now I'm like thinking about it too much. See, like this one sucks in comparison. Yeah, she she's not as cute. Like I'm not, a f I'm definitely not a fan of her, but like her, I'm obsessed with her. This one reminds me of when Napoleon Dynamite drew his prom date and gave it to her as a prom invitation and she was disgusted. Maybe I'll try one more time. Maybe I'll draw a cat. Okay, the cat sucks. I'm literally a one hit wonder with art like this. Looks like a toddler drew it. This looks like a fucking angry toddler drew it. This should be in the Museum of Modern Art. It doesn't make sense. Let's go run our errands. Oh, fuck, I put too much in there. Nobody's talking to me today. Also, why is it 80 degree? I'm fucking sweating my balls off. I'm fucking sweating my balls off. So basically, here's the errand. And do you know what? I'm gonna make it fun. The errand is that I need to return a few pairs of jeans. It's 80 degrees and I'm sweating, but I'm not wearing anything under this, so we're just gonna have to roll with it. At least we got out of the house. That's a really good first step, everybody. I'm about to get sweaty as fuck. Did I even put on deodorant? Fuck, I'm gonna be stinky, stinky, stink, stink very soon. Wait, is this store closed? It's closed. The store, the store is closed. I can't even return my bat. That hurted. That did hurt me though. Can we just get the lighting right, Jesus Christ? I mean, seriously. Sorry, I did not mean to say his name in vain. That was rude. We're going to Whole Foods now. We're gonna go grocery shopping. Maybe I'll try some fun new snacks or get some fun new ingredients. I think I need to go home and do my makeup. I need a little ego boost or something. Because looking in this viewfinder is making me really worry about a lot of stuff. But that's what it's about though. Sometimes you, sometimes it's good to not be cute. Can you not stop in the middle of the road? You're so stupid. I did it. I did it. I was coming out of an aisle and somebody was walking this way. I was walking this way, but I couldn't see because I was in an aisle. We almost T-boned, um, not in a good way. Wait, I don't think T-boning, is, does that have a sexual, I hope that doesn't have a sexual connotation. I had a nice cashier, she was very nice. Thank you Whole Foods for that. And that was the end of it. I know what you guys want. I know what you little sickos want. You guys want a grocery haul. Although this is gonna be the most boring grocery haul of all time. So I got. Some cilantro lime dressing. This could be fun on vegetables. This other dressing and marinade. It's green goddess, although it's not really green. Sesame ginger, vinaigrette and marinade. One nice big head of cauliflower. Some good old fashioned broccoli. I got way too much of it. I got these um, Italian garlic and fennel plant-based sausages. I got some lemons and limes. I got avocados. 
How long are they gonna keep doing this? Minced ginger, almond, almond milk. I also got a new nut milk to try, which I think I've tried this before. It's the brand Malk. I can't remember if I've tried it, so let's try it right now. Also, don't get mad at me for drinking straight out of the container because I live alone. Oh fuck, that's pretty good. Dijon mustard with chunks in it. Dijon mustard without chunks in it. Two cans of light coconut milk for making soup. Wait, fuck, I forgot to buy, forgot to buy curry paste. So now I can't make my soup. Fuck! This is really not like substantial. I really kind of fucked up. Like I should have gotten more. Anyway, bye. It's a few hours later. You may be wondering, Emma, what were you doing? Well. I would watch TikToks for eight hours. Not eight, but like close to it. But anyway, I'm cooking, so I thought I'd pull out the can. First thing I'm making is tempeh. It looks gross right now, but basically tempeh is like a vegetarian meat substitute, kind of. And then I'm also warming up some of my soup. Let's feed the cats. I'm on my mommy shit. I like to mash it up with the can. It's disgusting, but... Uh, I did forget my camera was here, but I hope you enjoyed watching them eat. I think I made too much soup, but I was at this like awkward point where it was like, okay, I don't, like it, this isn't enough soup for two servings. So I'm just gonna try to eat it all at once. But I don't think it's a, the whole bowl is filled to the brim with soup. Like that's a lot of soup. So I'm just thinking about the future of my soup and it's like, once you warm it up again, can you put it back in the fridge? Like, I don't know how that works. Anyway, the oven is two degrees from being preheated, so I'm just gonna put it in now. That will go in there for 20 minutes. Literally, where is my phone though? Cause I need my phone to set the timer. Alexa, 20 minutes on the clock. But I don't have an Alexa, so it looks ready. Look how much fucking soup I made my phone. Way too much soup for me to eat in one sitting, check. It looks so good though. Ooh, let's see if it's even warm. It's perfect eating temperature. After I eat this, I'm going to bed, I'm done. But I love you guys and thank you for hanging out with me over the past 24 hours. I appreciate all of you so much and I wish you could try my soup because I bet you would think it was good. I believe in us and I love you so much and here's your forehead kiss. Okay, bye. See you next week, bitch!